Hello, welcome. I'm going to play Rambo First Blood Part 2 on the Sega Master System. You can see the title screen only says Rambo. It's also what the cartridge label says, but the box says First Blood Part 2. Really just to tie into the most recent Rambo movie at the time, which released in 85 and this game in 86. It's not based on either movie though. This is actually Ashura, a game that released in Japan in 1985. Sega of America brought it over, added the Rambo license, which basically just means changing what the main character looks like. He looks like Rambo now. So you can play as Rambo, but you're not really playing a Rambo movie. Although, who could really tell? <laughs> this is what Rambo does, shoots the bad guys and blows stuff up. Uh, uh, <laughs> I was gonna get hit. Yeah, it's a lot like the games back in '86, like in Akari Warriors. Walk vertically, shoot stuff, and don't get hit. Of course, Rambo is not indestructible in the game like he is in the movies. It only takes one hit to take him out. You only get three lives at the start. You can see in the corner of the screen, nine and three. Nine is how many explosive arrows I have. These buildings house prisoners, so you blow them up and they throw you something, usually more arrows. bad to slow down though because the enemies just keep coming. I'm not going to get very far I can tell you. I'm only going to get into the second level out of six levels. Oh, I did not expect him to get a second shot off that quick. I have noticed there is some randomizing in this game because the tanks show up in different places like, sometimes it shows up earlier and I'm just gonna leave it be <laughs> I'm gonna die again not yet anyway This is the end of the level right here. I just have to wait for that door to start flashing. So that's basically just shoot waves of enemies. In Europe, this game's called Secret Command. If you happen to own that game on like, Wii Virtual Console, this is the same game. But that one doesn't have the Rambo license. It's the same as the Japanese version of the game. died once. It's not too bad. I, I've gotten through it without dying, but that's only the first level. And with six levels, I'm, I don't think I've ever finished it. I don't remember, but I don't think so. I'm sure I'll, I'll end on this level. I mean, I'll go as, until I die, but I don't think I'll get past this level. And maybe, I guess, if you really don't worry about shooting the enemies and just run, yeah, well, those guys shoot fast, and it's hard to see under the tree cover there. Maybe that won't work. I was going to try seeing how far I can run without slowing down. Of course, the bridges get clogged up. game can be played co-op. The second character is called Zane, which 
Oh, I got hit in the back there. Now, Zane is not in the Rambo movies. <laughs> it's just a made-up character, unfortunately. I don't know why they couldn't just make him Colonel Troutman, or perhaps the woman that helps Rambo in First Blood Part 2. Maybe that's something to do with the cartridge. Because Zane is a clone of Rambo. He just a, has darker skin and a different colored headband. And I'm going to pull him in right now because Rambo's dead. And that's kind of a way of cheating, except you can only do that in the first two levels. Quickly pull the second player in as the first one dies and continue playing in a solo game, more or less. So yeah, this is Zane. He can't get through this bridge because <laughs> there's constantly a bad guy shooting down it. And grenades! Ah. Run! How did that not hit the building? Oh, well, let's just run. Run, Zane! Yeah, maybe all these levels are short. I don't really remember too well. Looks like the same deal. Wait for the door to flash. to level three. Well, there's a Rambo picture. The first picture, I guess, may have been him, too. It just looked like a ninja or something. <laughs> I don't know. Well, this doesn't look all that different, but... Ooh, that didn't go... <laughs> I was gonna say. They probably all look about the same. All the levels. Yeah, this is the master system. Like I said, it's a 1985 game, really, even though it released here in 86. So it's a rather old 8-bit title. I'm using Sega Genesis controllers, just because they're a little more comfortable than uh, the Master System. Or maybe a lot. <laughs> oh, you just got bombarded with bullets. Oh boy. Oh, can't even block. The tree's not blocking that. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot coming in. There is another Rambo game on the Master System, and that one is based on Rambo 3. That's why it's called Rambo 3. <laughs> it's a light gun game. It's kind of like an Operation Wolf style game, but it is based on the movie. Is this really the end of the level already? I did not expect to get this far. I guess if you just run not worry about saving everybody or taking on every enemy. It's, maybe it's not too hard. It depends how high a score you want. It's just it's too bad you can't shoot backwards because like, the enemies turn all over the place. the door. I gotta get it. Can I get it without dying here? Ah! 
No, I didn't make it <laughs> at the end of the level. Oh, that was cruel. Oh well, you almost saw level four. Alright, thanks for watching.